a lot if they're, they're trying to attach two shapes together and then merge the vertices together and, and do things like that. And so this is like a really big question I get asked often, so I'm making a video so everybody understands how to do it. When you're merging two shapes together and you want to merge the vertices together, there's a couple different ways to do this. First, what you need to do is you need to understand that you need to have both shapes selected and then in the mesh section, you are going to combine them together. That's going to give you one object. And then from there, you need to have two holes. So either I can do this a couple different ways. So I'll, I'll grab this and I'm gonna clone it. Um, first way to do this is to grab the faces. So you grab this polygon and that polygon and simply shift right click together and we're going to basically bridge these together. Bridge faces. And that will add those two together. Oftentimes, uh, that will create more geometry in the center. And so if that's the case, that's perfectly fine. Otherwise, what happens is we want to connect two pieces together, but we're gonna to need to manipulate it and we don't want extra geometry in there. So make sure those faces are deleted again because you can't delete faces together when you're merging vertices and they have faces in between. Go to vertices, go into select my two vertices here, shift right click and go to merge vertices to the center. So simply like that and that will merge them into the center. Then we can simply go and hit select G and select all the way around and that will merge vertices to the center as well. So you can see here really quickly, that will be another way to merge things together. So that's how you merge things together. You have to make sure they're attached. You have to make sure there's an empty space if you're merging vertices or you're using bridge and then you can use the face mode to merge things together. You can also do it via edge using bridge as well. So I hope that helps. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. And if you like it, subscribe. Um, I hope to hear from you soon.